What's up, YouTube? Okay, people. Today, working on a transmission from a 2006 BMW 550 um, 4.8 liter. And this one here has the ZF6 uh, HP28 transmission. <clears throat> Got a code for 4 f uh, 85 so what I did was I changed the fluid replaced all the solenoids and car drove and as it hit third gear it revved up to about four or five thousand and then went into fail safe mode so <clears throat> after you know that happened that's when I decided to just you know change all the solenoids and the fluid and the filter and that didn't work so I had to do a full tear down of the uh, of the transmission and after I did that I found that the e-clutch was all burned up <clears throat> this is the e-clutches right here looks like a bunch of uh you can see here I don't know, hold on. Looks like a bunch of steel. There is no clutch there. It's all burned up. So uh, I bought a whole new uh, master kit to rebuild the transmission. These are the old clutches that came out. They were looking pretty, like, pretty much new from the other gears. Um, uh, can you see it there? Let me see. There you go. It's a little burnt, but not too bad. And the steel was a little burnt, but it wasn't too bad. But those right there was, they were just burnt up like the fluid was burnt. There was no fluid in the transmission. Uh, when I first got the car, I checked the fluid. There was no fluid. Maybe I like, had like two quarts and it was running low, so. It looked like the fluid leaked out and they're burning up the clutch. So I tried to, you know, bring it back, but it didn't work. So I had to rebuild the whole transmission. And uh, basically, that's what usually happens <clears throat> when the fluid runs low or clutches go bad or, you know, wear and tear. Usually, number four is uh, E clutch is usually the first one to go bad and burn up because that's the one that's most used. Um, so 4F, uh, 85 code, if you guys replace the fluid and the solenoids, then most likely you have to rebuild the whole transmission, change all the bushings, the seals, everything, which I just completely did. This transmission here, which is on the ground, <clears throat> I got it out, take it out, <clears throat> looked like it was replaced once before has a marking on it same as the uh, torque converter was replaced also so getting ready to put it back in tomorrow but I just want to make a little short video of the possibilities of that code what it could be you know uh, give me a like and subscribe I will be doing some more videos so you know if you guys have any questions just uh leave a comment for me or any you know leave leave a question there and i'll try my best to uh <clears throat> respond back in uh in the quickest possible fastest time as possible all right people till the next video